30. I'm up over to 39 defense on them, plus my three cripples, so I'm like 42 defense on the slot two. Plus it's giving me an extra 15 defense on slot one. Um, for Oh man, I just really dumb this rumble. Just been too busy. I started off different PCs is a bad choice. So what I'm going to do here, um, I'm afraid of that payback a little bit. Ooh, now he's really going to take damage, but um, I was going to start healing a bit on the slot too. But quite frankly, with Cognac there, diminishing punch is um, giving him an extra 15 motivate and 15 hijack. I'm going to go ahead and just move in for the kill here. I don't I don't need that boy witch doing crazy shit here. Uh, he's still going to hurt me, but not as bad. So here we've got 48 damage coming out. Plus my cheer, 40, 50, 60, 80. we're going to kill him. So I'm never going to get a heal. We better just go for highest HP. Uh, 97, 95. Uh, that's being optimistic. Okay. I don't think we have any more left. Frequency. So I'm not a big fan of opening up with my Bob. He's seen him one. Uh, and I could... Fucking just one hit KO that bunny too, unfortunately. So this opens me up for a world of hurt. But at least I go first. And didn't combo, so we got that going. So I'm going to actually... Hmm. Hmm. He can get through. So I'm going to bring him down to, what, 14? But he cheers all plus two. I'm only going to bring him down one. So it's a 16. But I have 4 heal all. And this guy will only take 4 damage. So I'm going to go that route. Um, I was thinking about going with the witch. Get a little bit of heal in there. And I think I might get 1 heal here. So I'm going to kill him. Yeah. Witch should theoretically get a heal in. So I'm going to pop her in just in case I need it. Just in case I need it. Which I don't really think I will. Now, looking at it now, I'm going to get, what, 8 damage in slot 1. I think I might actually get both of these heals in. As long as slot 2 is beefy enough. And look at that slot, who is beefy enough. So, at this point, we've got a couple ways to do this. Now, I could go a little bit more damage here, which will cheer slot 4, and I get the heal. So, we hit 25, and then 23.9. Uh, and then slot 1 is going to do... Okay, so slot 1 is going to do, what, 11, 22 damage? Uh, 3450, that's going to bring me up to, what, um, 37 damage? So if I hit here 25, okay. So what I decided to do here is let him take some damage, him heal. She's going to hit but not die. Then I get the heal, and then it's going to boost up slot 4 for the plus 100. Um, I wanted to make sure when doing that math that Opera Franny didn't kill it, because I wanted the slot 4 heal to heal up slot 3 for the plus 100. So at least I played one match right. Um, what do we end up getting? 966, not great. But not bad. I'll take it. Um, so I'm trying to crawl back up, man. After that, I, um, I'm definitely not number 2, it's just early on. Um, I started with like a, a craze heavy deck, but I just don't have uh, the CM for it. I went two and two against Big Bad Wolves, and then uh, I've been undefeated since with Opera. I moved initially to Opera and Cognac, um, thinking that Cognac could boost Opera a little bit. I was really worried that like a slot one crazer or something came in, and I think. I was just going about it all wrong. 
Um, what I should have been doing is just being more uh, protective with my disguise PCs, those uh, those Steve PCs, and I've moved to that, and that's increased my score. It's not a dramatic increase from Cognacs, um, but I'd say probably an extra 30 points around at least. Um, so this is number eight, right? So looking at the rankings... Uh, this is going to end up sitting us right there on top with Big Bad Wolves. Um, but we're not going to play them again, right? We need four in between. So, they'll pretty much take who wins, what, Salt Mart and No Shelter. Um, I think they can play again. We can't play them again, so I think they'll play again. Um, Salt Martin loses there. Skull Crushers and Stranger Things. I think Stranger Things wins. Maybe Skull Crushers. I'm not sure. But we'll play the winner of them for number nine, right? And then we have one more match. So the match after that, uh, we're going to see SOS and Kill Care Bears winner playing Ace McCloud and Big Bad Robot. So we won't get the winner of them. We'll get the winner of maybe Sweet Hellhounds Road Rising versus MLL World of Marvel. But we will have some drops in there too. So it is possible. Hopeful. That Snoo Snoo drops down in here. Um, and gets in this mix. So Because they won't be able to play Big Bad Wolves again. So... I think it's quite possible that they fall down in here um, and then we get them for number 10. Now, I'll have to ask my Demical. I don't fucking know. This is just like guesswork, but he actually does that MMR math. Um, yeah, but either way, we'll see what's up. Sorry, that's a long video, guys, but I did promise you I was going to take my time and I was going to try and fuck sakes, I, I tried. <laughs>